Hi, I'm Bridget DiBerardinas. I live in Miami Beach, Florida, where I'm a bartender, spirit, and cocktail enthusiast. I choose to use Safest Choice pasteurized eggs in my cocktails without the worry of egg-related salmonella. I can be as creative as I want with the peace of mind that my guests are safe while enjoying my cocktails. Let me show you how to make some of my favorite creations. So now I'm going to show you how to make one of my personal favorite classic cocktails called the Pisco Sour. First, we're going to start with a Safest Choice pasteurized egg. I'm going to go ahead and crack it, and you really only want to use about a half ounce to three quarters of an ounce of the egg white, just to ensure you taste the cocktail and not only egg. Next, I'm going to take my Pisco, which is an unaged grape brandy, and uh, this one happens to be nice, bright, and floral, so it really, really shines well with the combined ingredients. We're using an ounce and a half of the Pisco. Next, I'm taking my fresh lime juice, and please make sure that it's fresh, it has a major impact on the cocktail. We're going to use three quarters of an ounce, right in there. Following that is our simple syrup to give us a little bit more balance. And now we are going to shake. When you're shaking egg white cocktails, you want to make sure you give it a good long, at least 20 long count shake. That way you really light up the cocktail and you get that silky frothy layer. I've been icing down my cocktail glass. You really want to serve this in a coupe. So I'm going to ice down my cocktail glass to make sure it's nice and cold. Then my ice. You're really not done shaking the egg white until you break a sweat, so remember that. Okay, and we're going to strain right into there. So look at that beautiful foam right on top. It's just wonderful. And because of the egg white, we're able to add some of our Angostura bitters, and it just sits right on top. You can even make a little picture, and I'll show you how to do that. So you're going to take a cocktail pick, and I try to draw little hearts sometimes if I have a lady sitting at the bar, or we can do funkier things like a mustache if you're really good with it. Just get creative. And there you are. Enjoy.